you see these dogs in your front yard? <laughs> Just know upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. Tank is low. I'm trying to race that M5 and I ain't got no gas. I'm crazy. I was gonna definitely run them though. Pull up to this pump, get some gas, man. Best E85 on the south side, man. I might remember this spot. I've been here before a couple times on the channel. Oh shit. No! Ah. Uh. Some gas, man. Oh shit, they changed up. Damn, man, the gas cheap up. Uh, put some gas up in this guy so we can go on about our day. Oh, I know they got COVID on it. That's disgusting looking. But oh well. I done had COVID like three times already. I think I'm immune to it now. It don't matter. What's up in here? I ain't gotta check the pump over here. Most, most of the time the gas over here is always on E85 or better. That's why I, I drove all this way when I could've just been at the crib. But yeah. Good old on 3 twin turbo kit, man. Like I told y'all, man. I don't know if y'all like how closely y'all follow my channel, but for the people that follow my channel, y'all seen the issues that I came up with. 
and none of them has been um none of them has been with the actual turbo kit itself it's always been something it's always been something that that i created myself basically like it's been little small issues that come with high boosted cars and stuff like that it's never been um twin turbo kit failure or nothing like that it's always just been some minor so i would recommend i would recommend this kit to somebody that was you know looking for some boost looking to go fast looking to um the um get a lot faster i would definitely recommend this kit to you but yeah if you're thinking of going with a um if you're thinking of going with an on three twin turbo kit i say go for it man don't listen to what um like i said don't listen to the to the naysayers and what all the other people be saying they don't man look everybody want to go by price they think the more money you spend, the better quality. In some cases, it is like that. But, like I said, I haven't had a, one problem with this kit since I had it. I even I even blew my engine before anything happened with the kit. That lets you know right there that this kit ain't nothing to play with. My engine left the building before something went wrong with the kit. Get you somebody that knows what they're doing to in, install the kit. Don't just let your... Yeah, 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 uh, your homeboy that, that's a half-assed mechanic, do it. Nah, take it to somebody that's certified. Take it to somebody that, that you've seen they work before. You know that they know what the hell they doing. Like, cause, cause the kid is fine. It's like, like, like I said, I've heard stories about it being, like, kind of hard to, to install or like, or like, it's, um, it's a little tight squeeze, some little things, some, some kids be missing some little small things or not, but like I said, if you got somebody that's mechanically inclined, you don't gotta worry about that. Like, don't try to install it yourself if you don't know what the hell you're doing. Yeah, baby, I love the kit. I got a um, I got um, a on three twin sixty kit. I went with like my turbos aren't the biggest, but I did I did that on purpose so I can have quick spool times like. My car don't take as long as other cars do to spool up. My car is kind of like instant. Like, we kind of get to the business as soon as it starts. Like, I can show you an example real quick. Let me, let me speed up a little bit so I can show you what I mean.
it's been about 4,000 miles, 4,000 miles of me having this kid. And it's been about 4,000 miles of me having this kid and I haven't had any issues. Any, like any issues whatsoever. Like any issue that I had, it was, it, it, it was my fault, it was in the car. So like, like I said, you don't have to believe me. You can go out and spend $10,000 on a kid and we cross paths and I might beat you. Or you might beat me, who knows? So, you know, like, like, take it from me, man. I, I, I never listen to what other people say. I, I, I like to experience things by myself, bad or good. Like, like doing that, sometimes it's worked in my favor, sometimes it hasn't. So, I'm not saying that, that my success rate is high. I'm just saying that I, I like to, I like to see things for what it is by myself instead of going by what other race car niggas say on forums, other race people say on like online and stuff like that. Like, go with your, go with your own, with your own brain, man. Don't be listening to them people. Yeah, but like I said, man, at the end of the day, it's your money, man. You do whatever you want to do with it. But if you, if y'all wanted to know my opinion on the Turbo Kit, like I said, man, I say I think y'all should do it. I think um, if you're thinking about buying one, I, de I definitely think you should go ahead and make that purchase. You won't be, you won't regret it, man. I promise you, you won't regret it. This is not sponsored by Owner Three or none of that. This is just my true, honest opinion. Like, it works, man. The kit works. Like, look, look at the tires that I'm on. I'm on, I'm on ET Street Radio Pro, and bro, when I tell you, I be roasting these joints, bro. Like, like bro, I be glazing them joints like on the highway. Like it's crazy. Like, with the boost turned up on like 16 pounds, 17 pounds, I can't get traction to save my life. Like, it's crazy. But yeah, man. Like, like I said, I got this. Um, I'm on E85, whatever, whatever. But like I said, this. The kit is definitely worth it, man. Like, I run dumps on mine. I don't have my full exhaust on or anything like that. I just run a dump setup. But if you're thinking about doing it, I'm telling you, go ahead and do it. Like, you won't be disappointed, man. Like, like, hey, if you know somebody with the other brand turbo, tell them race me. Tell them let's, let's set something up so we can see. But, yeah, like I said, key thing is make sure you get somebody that's mechanically inclined to install it or take it to a shop if you don't know what you're doing don't do it by yourself if you if you a half-ass mechanic don't do it because you're going to end up doing half-ass work <laughs> it's that simple that goes for every setup with every car if you want the things to if you want everything to go right make sure it's installed right so yeah man it's, it's 302 man i'm finna check up out just letting y'all know that O and three turbo kits are not bad. Stop saying that. Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day, man. We out. Hey, follow 302 Nightmare. Uh, fucking like, subscribe, and that's it. Comment too, bitch. <laughs>